Right, it's Saturday morning, we're up, we're awake, and we are off to Lucy's hotel. We're going to drop all our bags and stuff there, have some breakfast, and just get ready for the big show. The show that we've waited for, for months and months and months. Not just that, that's when they announced it, but I personally been waiting for this show for absolute years. I've wanted them to bring a stadium show to the UK for so, so long. This may be the culmination, the high point of my wrestling fandom. Oh, look who I bumped into. Wait, <laughs> six years in the making, son. Six years in the making. That's so, it. you've not watched any wrestling? Not at all. Since my, my last full show was WrestleMania 31. That we went to. Where we went to. The vlog is where, on yeah. my channel. You should all watch YouTube, it. YouTube, annual things. <laughs> but, why are you here today then if you've not watched wrestling in so it's, long? It's, 30 years in the making. Tell the like, people. You've got to be here. You've got to be here. It's the vibe. It's the atmosphere. It's, it's the vibe. Feeling. 30 years in the making. You like, know WWE would have a good show. That's it. No, I, I don't follow any storylines, <laughs> but you've got to be here now. Right, so Rick and Johnny have finally turned up. What's, what, what's your highlight? What are you looking forward to? Uh, Drew winning. Drew winning? Yeah. You Roman think it's going to happen? Roman finally not being the champion. Yeah, an actual Scotsman for a change, and not a fake one. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Johnny? Looking forward to seeing Edge. Edge? Edge. Just seeing him? Yeah, never seen him wrestle before, so that's going to be a highlight for me. Have you not? So we saw him, remember, against Roddy Piper, funnily enough. We did when... At the NBN? Yeah, and then Piper went out injured, and that's when they found out he had cancer, and that's when he had to retire. There you go. It looks a lot different than yesterday, doesn't it, Chris? Yes, a lot different. Good. What are you looking to buy today? Either a teddy bear or an AJ Styles t-shirt. Oh, teddy bear for yourself, yeah? No, for my daughter. Look who I bumped into. It's my man, Danny. It's very exciting. I get Nola Fields. Yeah. Well, maybe. A bit. Hey, do you know maybe what? I've just had too much to drink. No. So when did you get in? Uh, last night. So you might recognise Danny from our WrestleMania 33 videos, right? This is very much like Nola because it's all in one place. Yeah, everything's, everything's so tight in together. And it's pub to pub, rock bar to blues bar, everything. It's really cool. And what are you looking forward to most? Um, beer. Uh, no, uh, in terms of wrestling, um, probably um, Seth versus um, Riddle. Here we go, gate three. Big Roman sign there. Nice little statue over here. Sir Tasco Watkins. And here it is. Stadium Principality. Yes! Come on, let's get in. I'm inside the arena and the seats are way better than I thought they would be to be honest with you. Still a bit low down for my liking, I'd prefer it to be like a bit higher up but what can you do? It's quite near the entrance ramp so some people are going to get some really nice like high fives at like the old Madison Square Garden style when they come down the entrance ramp. And it's like you just lean over and grab them, like high five wise. I don't mean grab them, like don't grab them, don't grab them. Um, looking forward to this. Chris is gone getting some merch. I'm inside, I'm buzzing. Let's hope it's a good show.
Right, we've just had the pre-show. Pretty decent match, but now we're going to be getting on to the main show. Let's go.
Perfect. Drew, all these people here tonight came to see you. Fury to come and sing American Pie. For a while, anywhere it made me shiver, with every paper I deliver, my news on the doorstep, I couldn't take one more step. I can't remember if I cried when I read about his widow bride. So deep, deep inside the day. Thank <laughs> you. 
So Chris, the show is over. What do you think? I no, thought it was awesome. Right. I got to see, got to see Tyson Fury sing at the end. Right, so we've got to the end of the show. As you can see, the seats are closer than it looks there. I thought it was a really good show. For the main event, they did it brilliantly. They didn't get Karrion Cross too involved. They didn't get Tyson Fury too involved, but they included them both enough that it was kind of satisfactory without kind of being too obvious what they're going to do. Because everyone all week was saying, everyone was a smart ass saying Fury's getting involved, Karrion Cross is getting involved, Braun Strowman's coming back, Bray Wyatt's. None of that happened. None of that happened. People, they like to get too carried away with themselves. But this show, it was really, really good. Dominic turning on Ray. That one was another one everyone called. Still turned out pretty well. All in all, I'm glad that I came. I hope they come back next year, but I guess we've got to wait to see what the gate receipts are like, how much money they're going to make, what the turnover's like in America, if people are actually bother watching or they treat it like a Saudi show, they kind of sack it off a little bit. There's a lot going on involved. But I hope they come back next year. I'd love to be back again. Stadium's emptying out now. Like, just look how massive it is. When it's empty, you can really see how massive it is. Like, oh, thousands and thousands of people. They say 60,000 were in here today. It was so massive. We were pretty close, and still the view wasn't brilliant. Like, the view's like a little bit better than what I'm looking at through my camera lens right now. But like, still not brilliant. Everyone's filtering out. There was the stadium. Chris was desperate for a smoke. Absolutely desperate. Go on, tell me who you're forcing the show. Go on. Oh, I say, but I'm heartbroken at the same time. And why is that? Dominic chose tonight of all nights to double cross Ray. What is he like? For the first time, 